Hello, guys. Welcome back to Amalubi Channel, where you can learn more interesting information about your favorite actors and athletes. The main character of our video today is Latif Crowder dos Santos. Latif Crowder dos Santos is a Brazilian American actor, stuntman, and martial artist. He was born on November 23, 1977, in Salvador, Bahia, Brazil. Most well known for his capoeira based fight scene in the 2005 feature film Tom Young Gong, The Protector. He's also notable for his roles in the movies Ninja Cheerleaders and Never Surrender, as well as his stunt work in the films Sucker Punch, The Book of Ali, and Disney Plus original series The Mandalorian. Latif Crowder dos Santos moved to San Jose, California at the age of four and started training in martial arts when he was six years old. With great experience and training in capoeira, taught by his father and gymnasts, he became an international competitor and became a member of the Zero Gravity stunt team. Latif has since been working on his own acting career. Latif Crowder dos Santos is best known for his appearance in Tom Young Gong, known in North America as the Protector, using capoeira in a fight scene with Tony Ja. Due to an injury to his Achilles tendon, the scene was cut short, but he has since recovered and was featured in the martial arts feature Duel of Legends, released in 2007. Due to his capoeira skills and resemblance to the character, Latif Crowder played the role of Eddie Gordo in the Tekken feature film. He has also featured in a disputed part 3 with stars Scott Atkins and Mikhail Jenkins. Directed by Isaac Florentine and also stars in the Kevin Tanjiro and directed short film Mortal Kombat Rebirth. Another memorable work of Latif was in the fight scene, as a representative style and test to show the defectiveness of his kicks. In 2019, he appeared in Disney Plus original series The Mandalorian as a stunt double for Dean Dejarin, The Mandalorian. Concerning the movies that play vital roles in uplifting Latif's career, we can never forget the names like Falcon Rising 2014, One of Women 2017, Furious 7 2015, etc. He also appeared in movies like My 22 2018, The Twilight Saga Breaking Dawn Part 2 2012, Mortal Kombat Rebirth 2010, and many others. He has also been featured in multiple internet short videos and demo reels such as Inmate 451. As of 2022, Latif Crowder has a net worth of $3 million, which he amassed from his acting and stunt career. Crowder was in a brief romantic relationship with his then girlfriend, Andresa Velotti, until 2013. The former lovers started dating in 2009, and the further their affair by quickly giving birth to three children. As of now, Latif Crowder is living a single yet happy life. So how do you think about him? Leave a comment and let us know. And don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button to support our channel. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the upcoming videos on the Molly channel.